rupture, hemorrhage, poor maternal effort, bloody, failure. These are all frightening words that no mother giving birth likes to hear. In nature, adrenaline slows down birth. In fact, we use it in hospital to suppress contractions that occur too early or too strongly. During birth, it therefore makes sense to reduce natural adrenaline by reducing anxiety. Here at Liverpool Women's Hospital, Professor Andrew Weeks is trying to change the language used by medical professionals with positive results for both mother and baby. Just the word hemorrhage, fetal distress, membrane rupture, these suddenly conjure up really quite uh, terrifying uh, images in people's minds sometimes. Dr Natalie Mobbs, who works with Professor Weeks, had a very personal experience of the right language in childbirth. She gave birth to baby Marlowe just eight weeks ago. She spoke to her midwife in advance about the words she'd like used. So I asked her to avoid words such as contractions, so instead we focused on surges and it being a positive kind of energy rather than a contraction sort of is a quite a scary word really and you think of something tightening up and that was what we wanted to avoid. I wanted to stay relaxed. Baby Carilia is just 22 hours old. For mum Adini, the right use of language made all the difference during her birth. When they use the correct language, they make me calm and confident and I can get delivered very, very fast. Think about the words you're using. Try and avoid violent language. Try and avoid rupture, distress, um, because sometimes how we give care is just as important as what care we're giving.